Hello friend, I have a devotional to share with you. It starts with this scripture, bring them here to me, Matthew 14, verse 18. Do you find yourself at this very moment surrounded with needs and nearly overwhelmed with difficulties, trials, and emergencies? Each of these is God's way of providing vessels for the Holy Spirit to fill. If you correctly understand their meaning, you will see them as opportunities for receiving a new blessing and deliverance you can receive no other way. The Lord is saying to you, bring them here to me. Firmly hold the vessels before him in faith and in prayer. Remain still before him and stop your own restless working until he begins to work. Trust him to work. When the trials that threaten to overcome you with discouragement and disaster, in God's hands, they will become opportunity to reveal his grace and glory in your life. In ways you have never known before, bring your needs here to me, writes A.B. Simpson. My God will meet all your needs according to his glorious riches in Christ Jesus, Philippians 4, verse 19. And you might want to mark that in your Bible. It's so encouraging. What a source, God. What a supply, his glorious riches. What a channel, Jesus Christ himself. It is your heavenly privilege to trust all your needs to his glorious riches and to forget your needs in the presence of his riches. In his great love, he has thrown open to you his exhaustive treasury. Go in and draw upon him in simple childlike faith, and you will never again have the need to rely on anything else because you may lean fully on him. And Psalm 23, 5 reminds us that my cup overflows. Margaret E. Baber wrote a poem based on that verse. There's always something over when we trust our glorious God. Every cup is overflowing, his great rivers all broad. Nothing narrow, nothing sparing, ever springing from his store. To his own he gives full measure, overflowing evermore. There's always something over when we, from the Father's hand, take our portion with thanksgiving, praising for the path he planned. Satisfaction full and deepening fills the soul and lights the eye. When the heart has trusted Jesus, all its needs to satisfy. There is always something over when we tell of all his love. Unreached depths still lie beneath us. Unscaled heights rise far above. Human lips can never utter all his wondrous tenderness. We can only praise and wonder and his name forever bless. He who did not spare his own son, but gave him up for us all, how will he not also, along with him, graciously give us all things? Tells us Romans 8, 32. May this bring you hope today.